Hello guys and gals, this is Travis Tidwell with Form.io and I'm here to show you how to easily create an AngularJS web application that integrates seamlessly into Microsoft Office 365. To accomplish this goal, we will be using an exciting new platform called Form.io, which is a revolutionary combined form and API platform built specifically for developers. If you haven't done so already, I encourage you to go to Form.io and watch our introduction video to get a better overview of our product offering. To get started, we will be leveraging a very powerful tool that we introduced that allows any developer to bootstrap an existing Form.io application on GitHub, which then points that application to an automatically generated Form.io project. The specific application that we will be using is one called the Sales Quote application, which can be found by going to github.com Form.io Form.io app dash sales quote. This application is an example field sales rep application that provides sales agents a mobile interface for creating new sales opportunities out in the field, which then tightly integrates to Office 365 calendar, contacts, and Outlook email system to further support all of the internal workflow necessary for a company to run their business. So let's get started. The first thing we want to do is set up our application in Microsoft Azure. There are a lot of tutorials out there about this, so for brevity, I'm going to skip over the specific configuration steps other than just to let you know that I have an application that is set up with delegated permissions of Office 365 Exchange and Office 365 Unified API permissions. So now that I have an Azure application ready to go, I can move on to bootstrapping the sales quote application on GitHub. To start that process, you will first need to install the Form.io command line utility, which can be installed by opening up your terminal and typing npm install g Form.io cli. Once this installs, you can then bootstrap this project on GitHub by typing one single command, which is Form.io bootstrap then the URL to the application that is on GitHub, which in this case is github.com formio formio-app-salesquote. This first brings up a prompt for your Formio username and password, which if you don't have one already, now is a great time to go to portal.formio to create a free account. Simply type your credentials here and then press enter. The bootstrap process now recognizes that this particular app supports Office 365 and is now prompting me if I would like to configure that. So of course I'm going to say yes. It then asks me about my Azure tenant ID and client ID, which is provided for my Azure application. Then followed by my email address for my Office 365 account, and then I press enter. The next step is for it to generate the credentials, which will establish a secure connection between Form.io and the Azure application. This generates a self-signed certificate, which we can create by answering just a few simple questions. We can then copy the provided credentials configuration, then head over to our Azure application and click on Manage Manifest, then click on Download Manifest. We can then add this configuration within the Key Credentials Array item, save the file, and then re-upload that to Azure. And that's it. We are done with our configuration and now have a full working application within Form.io. And this application automatically integrates into your Office 365 account. To demonstrate this capability, let's first create a new sales agent by heading over to Form.io, which we will now see that we have a new sales quote project that was created through the bootstrap process. This project serves as the backend API platform for our running application. So when we head into this project, we should see some resources and forms. We can click on the agent resource and easily create a new agent by filling out the form and pressing submit. This not only created a new agent login record for my application, but it also utilized the Office 365 contact action, which you can see in the action section. Among many other form actions that we provide, the Office 365 contact action automatically created a new contact within my Outlook, which I can see by just opening up my Outlook, which I will see that there is a new item created in my contacts. I can also edit and delete this record within Form.io, and it will stay synced with my contacts within Office 365. So now that I have a new sales agent record, I can use that as a login to the application. Once I'm logged in, you will see that I can create new sales opportunities, customers, and contracts, all of which are resources within my Form.io project. Another thing to note is that each of these forms are dynamically rendered and automatically linked to the API platform, which includes an integration into Office 365. There are a lot of other features that I encourage you to play around with, such as e-signatures, Outlook calendar events, and WYSIWYG created content, as well as a full admin interface that exposes other elements only to the admins of the application. For brevity's sake, I'm going to save all of that excitement for those who actually bootstrap the application and try for yourself. So go ahead and try for yourself, and have fun building your next Web 3.0 application on Form.io.